Good morning. Welcome to the Early Learning Child Care Centre. How may I help you? Hi, I spoke to you last week about enrolling my daughter for next year. Oh yes, I'll just get some details from you. So you're her mother. That's right. And can I have your name? It's Carol. Carol Smith. And your daughter's name? It's Kate. Now we have several groups at the centre, and we cater for children from three to five years old. How old is your daughter? She's three now, but she turns four next month. I'll put four down because that's how old she'll be when she starts. Fine. She's so excited about her birthday and coming to the centre. Oh, that's good to hear. And what's your address? It's forty-six Wombat Road. That's W O M B A T Woodside four o three two. And what's the phone number? Oh, it's. Three three four five nine eight six five. So, have you decided on the days you would like to bring your daughter here? I'd prefer Monday and Wednesday if possible. Hmm. I'll check. Monday's fine, but I think the centre is already full for Wednesday. Ah,、uh, yes. Sorry, it seems to be a very popular day. We can offer you a Thursday or a Friday as well. Oh dear. I suppose Thursday would be all right because she has swimming on Friday. Okay, got that. Because a lot of parents work, we do offer flexible start and finish times. We're open from seven thirty in the morning until six o'clock at night. What time would you like your daughter to start? I need to get to work in the city by nine, so I'll drop her off at eight thirty. Mhm. You're pretty close to the city here, so that should give me plenty of time to get there. That's fine. Now we also need to decide which group she'll be in. We have two different groups, and they're divided up according to age. There's the green group, which is for three to four year olds, and then there's the red group, which is for four to five year olds. She's quite mature for her age, and she can already write her name and read a little. Well, I'll put her in the red group, and we can always change her to the green one if there are any problems. That sounds fine. Okay. Let's move on to meals. We can provide breakfast, lunch, and dinner. As she's finishing pretty early, she won't need dinner. Will you give her breakfast before she comes? Yes, she'll only need lunch. Now, does she have any medical conditions we need to know about? Does she have asthma or any hearing problems, for example? No, but she does need to wear glasses. Oh, I'll make a note of that. Yes,、yeah, she's pretty good about wearing them. She can't see much without them. Right. Okay. Now I also need emergency contact details. So, what sort of information do you need?、Uh, just the name and number of a friend or family member we can contact in case we can't get hold of you at any time. Okay. That'd better be my sister, Jenny Ball. Uh huh. That's B A L L. Her phone number is three three four six. Seven five two three. Great. So she is the child's aunt. Yes, that's right. I'll make a note of that as well. Now, is there anything you'd like to ask? What about payment? How much are the fees each term? Well, for two days and the hours you've chosen, that will be four hundred and fifty dollars altogether. Okay. And do I have to pay that now? No. We send out invoices once the children start at the center. You can choose to pay at the end of each term, or we do offer a slightly discounted rate if you pay every month. Oh, I'll do that then. I find it easier to budget that way, and I'm not used to the term dates just yet. <laughs> Good. It makes it a lot simpler for us as well. Well, that's everything. Would you like me to show you around the centre?